Hyperlinks VX 2.4 brings added support for RigidFlex and multiboard analysis. RigidFlex designs are now supported in Hyperlinks Power Integrity. Mentor's solution in Expedition is to create unique individual board regions that are either flexible or rigid, all in the same design. Hyperlinks PI will support these unique stack areas and their individual characteristics. DC drop analysis can be performed on these rigid flex designs. After assigning our models, we can run the simulation and see if there are any points of failure. A report will automatically be invoked. And for this example, we have found a failure in the max current density. Using the hyperlinks power scope, we can inspect this point of failure. 2D and 3D views are supported within the hyperlinks power scope, as well as an inspection feature to highlight points on the board such as where a signal layer is, where a point of failure is actually occurring. This becomes especially important when viewing multiple boards. Since multi-board simulation is now supported, if you have a true multi-board project with connectors in between various PCBs, you can now also perform DC drop simulation on all of these boards at the same time. Note that the connector model losses will also be accounted for when simulating a multi-board project. We hope you enjoy the latest release of Hyperlinks Power Integrity software.